Hello, this is Drew. I thought I'd do something a little bit different today. I'm going to do a mini biography on an artist that I've been watching lately and uh, become an instant fan. Uh, the name of the artist is Song Dong MTP, and I'm going to give you a little bit of a biography about his life. Song Dong MTP is one of the most well-known artists in all of Vietnam. From the time that he debuted in 2012 uh, till now, he's released about 17 songs. He has all started a movie called Din Phong, or The Dandelion. You might know some of his songs, uh, his earlier songs, Am Kung Ngai Hong Wa, up to his latest song called Black Troy. Very, very popular artist and very talented. He was born in 1994 in the city of Thai Bien, uh, which is in the north of Vietnam, Thai Binh City in the Thai Binh province. He is the oldest of two brothers. His dad was a businessman and his mother was a singer at uh, the Thai Binh uh, Theater, or a former singer at the Thai Binh Theater. His mom inspired his love for music. He studied piano and started singing at a very early age at the Thai Binh Youth Center. He participated in many children's music festivals. But it was really in high school that he started his career as a singer, when he was a senior in high school. He started experimenting with music and composing music when his uncle gave him an old computer that he had, and he had music software that he downloaded from the internet, and uh, basically a microphone. And he he, uh, he created a, little, a mini studio at home in the room he was sharing with his brother. He formed a fan club in 2011. He released uh, some of his his early recordings on the fan club. It gained a lot of attention from listeners. His major breakthrough happened in 2012. When he finished high school, he decided to go for a career in music. He passed all the entry level exams at the Conservatory of Ho Chi Minh in the vocal music department. And he ranked pretty high in all of his examinations. Now his big break came after he shared his songs online. One of the songs called Gong Mua Quang Wa got the attention of a famous songwriter in Vietnam called Nguyen Kung. Now it was at this time that Mr. Kung nominated his song for Gong Mua Ngang Hua to the national television show Bai Hat Il Tik, which means the favorite song. It was at this show that he got to showcase his style and singing on a national stage. So it was a huge TV show that gave him a platform to showcase his singing ability and style. He definitely won, won the admiration of the judges with this performance. It had ultimately won the award for the most favorite song of the month for that. Now this success led him to get noticed by Van Productions, which is a big production company in Vietnam. In November of 2012, he joined Van Production. He officially changed his stage name to Song Tung MTP, which is Song Tung is his name. M stands for music, T for talent, and P for style. Now fast forward to 2014, He's with this production company, Van Productions, and they release his debut music video for Am Kung Ngai Hong Wa. This, this gave him international exposure with YouTube. It reached people that weren't just in Vietnam, but all over the world, so. Now during this time, um, there was a bit of controversy with with his song, Am Kung Ngai Hong Wa, where he was accused of violating copyright um, laws, where they thought his beat sounded similar to a, a different song. So as a result of this, Van Productions didn't take any responsibility for this, and they just left him on his own to deal with this scandal, um, copyright scandal. As a result of this, he left Van Productions. The song was blocked on YouTube and later reappeared as of uh, September 2017. It has about 
98 million views. Now, there wasn't any official legal claim over this copyright, but this ultimately led to his decision to terminate his contract with Van Productions. Later that year, he started a movie called Din Fong, which translates to Dandelion. He was nominated and he won the Golden Kite Awards nomination for Best New Actor. He received rave reviews. They just loved him. And in 2015, during the MTV European Music Awards, which was hosted in Milan, Italy, he won the Best Southeast Asian Act. In 2015 as well, he was one of the contestants on the TV reality show called The Remix. This show brought him closer to the Vietnamese public, bringing in massive amounts of views on YouTube. He got praised by a veteran songwriter, Bu Tien Hung, and uh, Lu Tung Hing stated that Song Tung MTP was a rare gem in Vietnam. In 2016, Song Tung MTP won the equivalent of the Grammys in Vietnam, which is called Gong Hing Singer of the Year. He was the youngest singer to ever receive this award. Now, in December of 2016, Song Tung left WePro Entertainment and established his own company called MTP Entertainment. His first release was Lac Troy, which is a hugely popular uh, song and video. You'll see that uh, Song Tung, being one of the most popular and recognizable faces in Vietnam, He's had many endorsement deals with Yamaha, Opa Smartphone, Omo, Jollibee, just to name a few. So you'll be hearing a lot more from this young artist and his, as his fan base continues to grow all across the world. So this is a little introduction or mini biography on Song Kung MTP. I hope you enjoyed it.